Okay, so these are the new Ruthenium NGK spark plugs that I got from my uh, Camry. And uh, I wanted to give you a close-up so you can really see. See how that's... How the center electrode is like very much like a platinum, but the top electrode's got this little, little tint sticking out. <laughs> and they're all like that. Let me, uh, let me get this a little closer up. Sorry, I'm doing this at my desk and just want to get you the best picture I can with my phone. Sorry, I'm using my phone. Anyway, ruthenium is supposed to be the next big thing uh, after iridium. Ruthenium. I don't know who she is, but. Hey, sounds like a winner to me. Now you got to see this on the back here. It has a picture of obviously on the top picture there. It's don't gap it. Now it took me a while to see what this picture is, but they're telling you not to use it in airplanes or in um, what do you call them? Gyrocopters or what do you call them? The, uh, I'm not sure what you call them. You know where you're flying a kite with a motor on your back. You're supposed to put them in hand tight and then give them a half to two thirds turn down. And they're made in Japan. Anyway, that's what they are. They do not have a uh, unscrewable top conductor. I'll give you the, the uh, close up here. This goes in my older Camry, four cylinder. Kind of a. Uh, shoddy work down there for NGK, but I guess it will work. Suppose, supposedly what this, uh, the benefits here are that uh, these things stay clean. They, um, they burn off all the scale that, that develops because they burn hotter and they burn longer and everything about them is supposed to be better than iridium. Uh, iridium was already better than anything you'd ever need but now it's even better. Now if they can make my car better so that it would be as good, that would be great. My car was uh, originally designed for double electrode platinums and uh, I ran them in, in there and I'm do, doing a test with the uh, iridium single electrodes and then I'm going to do a little bit of a test and this is just a personal test so I'm not really going to post my results but I just, I'm looking at gas mileage and uh, taking trips, day trips and stuff, and seeing if I can see any kind of a difference, what seems to be best. And of course, as what most people say is just use what the car was designed for. And I totally understand that because they understand how the um, how the flame kernel ignites in each cylinder with each type of cylinder head. And uh, anyway, it's, you know, I. I think uh, trying things is not going to be that much of a big deal. These were about $40, just so you know, shipped by Rock Auto. And uh, they just showed up. So I'm going to go put them in, and you're not going to hear anything about it. <laughs> All right, just wanted to show them to you, though. Remember, ruthenium. These are all the different box sides. I guess they're called Ruthenium HX. What the heck are we doing here? Alright, thanks for watching.